We're headed into the Mill Hollow Backcountry Yurt today. It's about a six mile ski in. We're about 10 minutes into the trail and I'm already super out of breath. <laughs> this is gonna be a long day, but we're gonna end up at the yurt and have some awesome food and drinks, so it's gonna be well worth it. For this trip, I'm using my 50 liter Waymark Gear Co pack and it's at about 34 pounds. Um, that's no tent because we are going into a yurt. So most of it is coming from food and clothes I wouldn't normally be backpacking with. Sweatpants, sweater, down booties, things like that. So it's on the heavy side. Um, it's also my first backpacking trip in about five months. So not used to the weight, but sure is good training. guys so you can see this cornice line right there snow bike triggered that a few days ago and one of his friends got caught they were able to find him with their beacon probe and shovel and he ended up okay but what we're doing right now is Ian is up ahead of me with Charlie and they're gonna go one we're gonna go one at a time just in case it starts to slide, I can see where he's at. And if I need to rescue him, he's gonna wait for me up there. And then when it's my turn, he's gonna stop and wait and make sure that I get through okay. It's kind of scary terrain through here, so we're just making sure we be, we're being careful and just taking our time. So, sure is beautiful out though. to make water by just boiling it. Um, what you want to do is start off with just a little bit of water, add in fresh snow, melt it. Um, it's all clean um, because it's fallen off the roof so I think it's fine. We did bring a water filter just in case but I think it's gonna be okay. Um, plus I like really cold water so I'm gonna give this a shot. Ian picked this up for me at the liquor store, Ava Grace. It's a rosé in a can and I stuck it out in the snow for a little bit and wow it's actually really tasty. I'm not usually a rosé fan but I really like this. 13% alcohol, I think it was about 4 or $5 so pretty good bang for your buck when you're backpacking. <laughs> 